Okay, I am back. Let's see exactly what's going on here. This place is creepy. A vivid green plant. And this one? A dark violet plant. And that one would probably be the same. Okay. Oh no, I got directions. I got choices. So we can go left or north. Let's go west. Oh no. It loops. No. Let's just keep going west. I don't know if it's a number of loops or there's a pattern. I'll do this a few times and see. Okay, and... Okay. I guess north it is. There we go. There we go. Okay, so it looks like the one path is wrong, the one is right. So now we have north, west, and south. And I'm going to assume that one is wrong, or two is wrong, and one is right. A pretty light blue plant. Do these plants have some kind of hint as to the correct direction, I wonder? Let's go north. Nope. At least they're kind of forgiving. They put me back where I was at. South is right. Okay. Now we got five directions. Ooh. Looks like a starfish. Let's head here. Nope. Here? Nope. Here. No. I feel like the magic conch shell. No. Here we are. Whoa, this is a different point of view. Do I still have my items, by the way? I do. Wow. Okay. Ooh, this is weird. It's like a castle in the sky, except very creepy. Oh, I can go this way. Oh, wow. Should I have came this way? Do I hear singing? Is someone here? Uh, let's, let's go back for a second. Yeah, let's, 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 let's not go there yet. A small pile of barrels. They're stuffed full of something. Full of what? A small bed made from a stump. That seems a little uncomfortable. Oh no. Oh no. I have to go over there, don't I? Oh no. Oh no, I have to go. Okay, sorry about that. My headphones were dying. Alright. <gasps> okay, that startled me for a minute. Why did I die? That was a cheap move? Oh no. Okay, I'm back here. I'm gonna save. I don't think there was anything in here I could grab. Do I hear singing? Is someone here? Okay, be careful what killed me last time. Oh. I'm a little scared. No! What am I supposed to do? Maybe I just don't go that way. 
If I walk close to the water, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Yes. Yes, I do. I tried to stay far away. I can't get any further than here. Oh, I can. Oh. I feel so dumb. I could have stepped down one more time. Oh, shoot. I messed up. Oh? Why? It's not tasty prey at all. It's a girl. Shouldn't have come out in the first place. Who? Who are you? You don't know me? I'm Nixie. Nixie? That fairy who lives in the swamp? Yes, indeed. I thought a handsome young man came along, but just a squirt. Oh, I'm so peeved. Because, you know, handsome young man would definitely be the catch of the day. Ha <laughs> ha. Say, could you bring me something nice, like a handsome young man? I'll let you through if you do. Otherwise, no dice. Why should I? I, I need to get to the Sandman. Please let me through. No can do. I'm in the mood for a shiny coin. Bring it and I won't drag you into the swamp. Because money is better than young handsome men. Alright, chop chop. Can I talk to her? Oh. Hold on, I missed that. Oh no, hold on, let me see that again. Say, isn't my skin so smooth? Less smooth, more slimy. What an impertinent... <laughs> What's an impertinent little squirt? I use Tibyung Dew on my skin every day, so it's always youthful and smooth. What's the point worrying about your skin in a swamp like this? Oh dear, have you yet to learn the importance of skincare? Such a squirt. Being in the water all day makes my skin rough too. Alright, so we're not getting by without a coin. Let's go rob this guy. Oh, I knew we had to come in here next. Mm. Hey, what are you doing in my house? Don't you know how to knock rude? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> he looks so goofy. Okay. He looks so goofy. Sheesh. Didn't even notice ya. Come on now, out with ya. Uh, who are you? What? Forgotten about me? The nerve of this kid. He's the tooth fairy, isn't he? Well, why should I know who you are? Because he's the tooth fairy and you're gonna give him your tooth. Come now, girl. I'm the Tooth Fairy. Tooth Fairy? You mean you're not a cute little girl? That's right. When you were little, I did, you know, under the pillow and all that. So what are you talking about? The Tooth Fairy doesn't exist. That wasn't a fairy, it was my dad. Stop, stop, stop. Say no more, my girl, seriously. A fairy dies every time you say that, baloney. There's few of us as it is. I'm sorry. Right, so long as you get it. But if you know business, get that all. I've got work to do. I do have business. I have a coin. What? Got no business in that with you. Um, do I just, no, don't I do it the proper way when I put it under the pillow? No, I guess I got to. Hey, Tooth Fairy, can I trade this tooth for a coin? Mm. No, no, that won't do. I don't want this big honking thing. I collect kittens' teeth, the ones that fall out to be replaced by new ones. Don't show me adult teeth. What? What? You're biased? You're biased and judgmental and picky? What? What? 
it. Hey, Swamp Kelpie thing, do, can you trade? Can I give you... Ah, uh, just a skin. Wait, whoa, 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 what was this? What was this juicy go gossip? Hey, where do you get that tip young stuff you were talking about? Oh, do you want silky smooth skin too? I stumbled over that. Tibion grass is a pretty light blue plant that grows in drywood forest. Even a squirt like you should see it right away. Uh, might it be for your boyfriend? I, I don't have a boyfriend. Oh, come on, Sophie, you know it's David. Now that I could have guessed. But I'll bet there's a guy you want this one, yes. <laughs> Sophie's silence speaks volumes. Okay, so maybe we go and get this uh, plant. And maybe we put it on ourselves and we get really young. Or maybe we put it on the tooth and it becomes little. It's around here somewhere. Where'd you go? Here it is. This must be the Tibion grass. If I put some dew on this tooth, will it become a kid's tooth? Put plant dew on the tooth. Oh! The tooth got tiny! Is it a baby tooth now? Got a child's tooth. That's some witchcraft right there. Woo! Some magic. All right, now the old guy Tooth Fairy can't complain that the tooth is too big. You would think he would want more tooth for his money. I mean, if I'm in the business of trading money for teeth, I would probably want more tooth for my money. But you can't judge a guy for having specifications and preferences. Oh, yeah, hold on. Hey, Tooth Fairy, I brought a child's tooth. Give me a coin for it. Oh ho ho, now that's what I'm after. I'll gladly trade a shiny coin for that. Now then, sleep on that bed there. Why? I swap the coin while children sleep so they don't see me in the act. You wake up on me and no coin, Missy. Wow. But I can't sleep. I have insomnia. Oh, is that right? Well, if you can't sleep, pretend, all right? Close your eyes. Indulge me. Okay, if I must. Your bed's also too small for me. Then just lay on top, sheesh. You're too serious, you are. Reminds me of somebody. Can I open my eyes now? Sure, sure. Ah, a coin. Got a coin. Thanks, Tooth Fairy. Sorry, I had to get a drink. Doing his voice was like murder on my throat. And now I have a coin, so let's go please her. Here, I brought a coin. Ah, it's so wonderfully shiny. Well done, you can pass now. Nixie, away! Oh, okay, never mind, I thought she was going... I thought she was going to move. Hey, can you tell me where the Sandman is? Ah, that's right, you did say you had business with Sandman. I never want to see this stubborn old coot myself. Just go straight ahead and there's a tiny house. That's Sandman's. You'll know it when you see it. What's wrong? Choked up? My mom told me about the Sandman when I was little. I got the feeling he was really scary. But I can't remember why. Scary? He's not scary. Sandman's just a fairy. You'll see when you meet him, Sophie. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright, let's go and find the Sandman. 
I'm going to save, actually. I'm starting to get paranoid. Especially after I saw these little fairy lights. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Well, that's not creepy. That's not creepy in the least. It is, but... What's this? Doesn't that look like something back here? Yeah, something resembling a birdcage. Should I be concerned about that? Oh wait, that's a cave right there that is... Huh. A signboard. It has some writing, but you can't read it. Okay? Maybe I should stop by the cave first. Let's do things in order. Oh, or not. It's pitch dark inside. Do I catch the little giggling children's spirits and take them with me? Can't read the sign. A very small house. Yeah, that must be his sandcastle, actually. I just now realized. Sandman? Sandcastle. Don't tell me. This is the Sandman's house. It's... it's so tiny. Is this a house for ants? How could I even get inside? Okay, so we have to find a way inside, which means we need to get small, probably. Huh. So nothing here. Do I get a cage, catch one of the giggling children will-o'-wisps, and... Okay. <laughs> Can one of you help me? And quit laughing at me? <laughs> Sorry, I had to. I can't go off the beaten path. Nixie, I need your help. Don't try to drag me into the swamp again. Oh please, it's my job. Lay off it, would you? <laughs> okay, Nixie. I, 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 I like Nixie. She's I warmed up for her. To fairy, I hate to talk to you again, but can you help me? Hey, was it really you who traded my teeth for money when I was little? Of course it was. You had some good teeth, well brushed like your mother's. I bought my first ice cream with that money. I've loved ice cream ever since. That's good to hear. That money is yours to spend. Makes me glad it served a good purpose. Hey, Tooth Fairy, why are your teeth so gross? Hmm? Huh? Well, my job is gathering kids' teeth. No time to care about my own. <laughs> okay, so that's it for now. I guess we'll find out where we're supposed to go and how to get into that cave, I imagine, in the next video.